Warren Smart, a fast swimmer. I would keep an eye on the clock a little bit here as far as the American record goes. It's 207.17 as you mentioned earlier. Josh Pernod set that back in 2016. And, it, and the one reason why I think it's possible is Matt Fallon went 31-9 on the third 50. In layman's terms, that is just unbelievable. He was over a second and a half faster than anybody else the third 50. He came back on the fourth 50. Did he come back enough to say, hey, I want to save a little bit for the night? Charlie Swanson out fast. Yet a guy that ended up 11th at the World Championships in this race last summer. Bottom of your screen has the lead. Now, there's Fallon right there. Watch him because he is a guy that will maybe seventh or eighth at the 100. He does it all. In fact, he was eighth at the 50. Let's see what he's going to be at the 100. He's seventh at the 100. 1024. He will not be seventh at the end of this race. I can guarantee you that. He has a tremendous back half of the race. Already starting to assert himself, so too is Josh Matheny in lane five. Swanson's lead evaporated. Look at this third 50. He's doing the same thing. Remember what I said, he was seventh at the 100, eighth at the 50. He's first, first 32 flat at the 150. Matt Fallon unleashing the stuff of legends here to come back and work his way into the lead here and looking to rock it ahead of everybody else towards a national crowd. He was 32 fast, flat the third 50, Jason. 32 six and he breaks the record, 32 five. Matt Fallon is flying. Matheny in the battle for second. Fallon gonna get it done from seventh to the win in the final 100 meters here to grab gold in the 200 breast. 207.71 within striking distance of that American record. Wow, and Matheny gets second. Two new guys to look for as they go along. And Matt Fallon, <laughs> here we go. That's right him, right there on that lane right there. <laughs> Seventh at the 100. He's 102.4, 103.3? Is that right, 103.2 coming home? Basically even splitting a 200. He has got one great back half of a race. This guy can get out a little bit better. He can get out half second faster at Worlds. He, he's got a shot. That's the fourth fastest time in the world this year. Matt, Matt Fallon taking the win. There is a disqualification. A.J. Pouch has been knocked out from lane number two, but it doesn't deny the top two, including the national champion, Matt Fallon, Josh Matheny there in second, followed by Jake Foster and Nick Fink. Our victor is with Kira. Matt, fourth f fastest time in the world, a national champion. Describe what your emotions were coming down that last 50. Um, I mean, I'm usually behind at the 100, so my entire emotions this last 100 was just kind of to get back in front of everyone and just stay in front. So yeah, I was feeling pretty nervous, but I kind of saw in the last 50 that I was turning ahead of some people next to me and I just kind of went for it. Now, speaking of emotions, you've had to battle back from quite a bit of injury. Take us inside that journey that's allowed you to get back to this winning position today. Um, yeah, I was out of the pool for a little bit, but I bounced right back and I was able to get working hard right after I was back in the pool and it's translated into some pretty good gains in the pool. So it's been pretty hard last couple months, but it's been worth it. And that hard work is going to get you on a world's team. How excited are you to represent uh, on an international team? I'm over the moon. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank you. Hey, Jason, before we go to break, 
I said he was 102, 103. No, 102, 4, 105, 2. That's still pretty solid. Certainly is good enough to grab a national title. Well, coming up, the women's 200 back. Hope we have a finish like we did at the 2018 U.S. National. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for the medalists, the men's tournament of breaststroke led by your champion, Matt Fallon. Matt Fallon on the podium with the other top finishers in the men's 200 meter breaststroke, getting their medals, posing for pictures, all part of the process here at the Phillips 66 National Championships. Again, Matt Fallon with his come from behind formula that works well for him. More B final action here from 